So unfortunately, there are not that many developments when it comes to new glutamate receptor antagonists for migraine. Few studies that had been attempted in the past um, didn't really reach the market. Um, they were tested in phase two mainly trials, and this included AMPA uh, receptor antagonist. Um, and then there was another uh, uh, Knate receptor antagonist that we showed actually, and I will show this um, data in my presentation that it's uh, it's a joint AMPA and Knate receptor antagonist. Then there was the MGLUR5 um, uh, modulating. Um, uh, uh, allosteric modulator, essentially, of the MGLUR5 uh, receptor, which also failed uh, to progress in further clinical trials. The main reason for uh, this uh, previous um, glutamate receptor antagonist failing to reach uh, further stages in clinical development and essentially reaching the market is because glutamate is very hard to be targeted given that is the main excitatory neurotransmitter in the brain. And hence, if you block glutamate, lots of side effects will occur. Also, it, it seems like we didn't really have specific receptor antagonists, as I said. And what we need to do in terms of future development is rather than try to block directly the glutamate receptors, potentially novel therapeutics could indirectly modulate the glutamatergic transmission. 